Hey guys, it's Kai. Um, real quick, I'm going to show some of you guys how to use the auto playing feature on the digital piano that's in this game. Um, it's a really good feature to use. It's simple. A lot of people just don't understand how it works. Um, the instructions are actually down here. But sometimes people are more visual than they are you know, reading, like I'm real hands on. Um, so the way this works is you need, obviously, piano sheet, virtual music sheet, um, which I use to virtual piano. It's a free website to use. Um, if you hit music sheets, it takes you to the main page. Um, which gives you a couple things to choose from. Um, these are categories. They have several different pieces of music in them. Um, you just click one. It'll pull up a huge selection. Um, a lot of it's stuff you may or may not know. Um, but you're just going to click one. And these have difficulties. Um, like this is an intermediate. If you don't use the automatic feature and you just go with the keyboard, that's cool. You probably already know all of this. Um, I go on and off between using the keyboard and the auto feature. It just depends on how I'm feeling that day. I've got carpal tunnel and arthritis, so it's not that easy some days. Um, but you're going to take this and you're going to highlight and copy. I do CTRLC to copy. If you don't know how a song sounds, or you kind of got an idea but you don't remember, hit play song. It's going to load up the keyboard. If you hit autoplay, it's going to play the song for you automatically. Okay. Um, you can hit pause and it'll stop. If you hit the start now, you can actually play like you would on the game, um, but this will follow you. And it'll tell you, you know, how good you did. Um, so that's a nice little thing to know. But if you take your music that you've copied, you're going to go back into the game, which I already had it loaded. In order to bring up the auto player, you need to, you'll bring up this little guy here to chat. You're going to put in the arrow, capital A-U-T-O, auto, okay? I already got mine up, so I'm not going to hit it again. But you hit enter, and it's going to bring up this screen, okay? In order for the automatic feature to work, you have to have your keybind set. Um, your keybinds, there's somebody walking around in the room. Um, keybinds are either going to be a dash, equal, a left bracket, a right bracket, semicolon, comma, or period. If you go down here to the gears, which is the settings, you're going to click it, it's going to bring up the screen. My keybind um, is the equal. It's just easiest for me to hit. Um, you can kind of set it to whatever ones you want it for, as long as it's like within this setting. If it's outside that setting, it ain't going to work. Um, as far as your music goes, you're going to paste that into here. Okay. Typically, if you're just playing to play, you would copy and paste it into here. And just go on with how you normally would. Um, so you got your key button set. You're ready to play. Okay. In order to get this working, obviously you've got your music here, you hit play, okay? A lot of people think you hit play, it just starts playing for you. That's not the case. When you're auto-playing, people are going to know you are using the auto-playing feature because it will say right above your head, auto-playing. Um, in order to stop, you hit stop, okay? An important thing to know is how to read this, okay? Um... So these are like single notes, okay? This is, these are in a bracket, 
they're going to be played together when you hit it. Okay, these are single. These are played one after the other. All right, these lines that you see are essentially the rests. If you've been in music class of any sort, you kind of know what you're looking at. Um, yeah, so you take this information that you learned and you bring it over here. You hit play. It can either sound really pretty or really bad. It all depends on if you know the music, how fast or slow you need to go. And you have to be used to how this plays because again, it's like you can either spam it. Okay. You can play it how you know it's played. As I'm playing, it's feeding the notes. Okay. Um, that took me a little bit to get used to, just reading it as it goes through. The more you play it, the easier it is, honestly. I enjoy it. It's fun. There's a lot of people that are like, oh god, you use auto player. So what? You know? Anybody can click down here and just start. You know, just start playing. It's however you want to play. Okay. There's, I've met some really nasty people that I didn't think I would ever meet just playing an instrument. Because <laughs> um, this is the only way some people get to play an instrument is digitally. <laughs> Sorry, I got a squeaky chair. Um... It's just, everyone's here for one thing, and that's to play music, okay? Whether you bash the keys or you just play to play, there's several different ways. Let people enjoy themselves and play, okay? But that's how you use the auto player. Um, if you're done with the feature, you don't have to clear that out. I just do as a habit. I don't know why you're a lingering person. Um, this will minimize your screen. You can actually drag this wherever you want it. Another important thing too is you can change how your piano sounds by hitting these buttons. All right. This sound will get carried throughout the entirety of the game. So wherever you go, if someone else is playing a piano and they're playing it, it sounds like bells to you. It's because that's how you have it set. I use the London feature because it's soft, it's pleasant to the ears, for me at least. Um, what else am I missing? And just the regular, you know, you backspace to get up and out. Um, yeah, that's how that works. Because that's really simple, it's straightforward. Um, hopefully this helps you guys that didn't really, like, kind of got it but didn't quite get it. Um, Oh yeah, and clicking your notes toggle will bring that up. <clears throat> but this, it, anytime you go to bring up another sheet of music, so you copy and paste something new, okay, hit play and then stop and it'll clear this out. So as soon as you hit that button, you're going to have that new fresh set. Alright, hopefully this helps you guys. I'm sorry if it's a little here, there, and everywhere. Um... It's like a last minute thing because I had a lot of people asking me how I play this. So that's how you play it. And I hope it helps. I hope you guys have fun and play beautiful music. I love you guys. Bye.